Hi there, this is John from cncroi.com and today we're going to take a look at engraving and cutting half inch MDF. Engraving pretty much any material out there is pretty easy with a CNC laser. We have the precision and the expertise to pull it off each and every time. The challenge comes with cutting. Here we have half inch MDF and here's the inside part. So it fits in you know, pretty good, friction fit. The challenge with this is because we have a gasket, uh, we have a lot of air going down on the material. That's to make sure that we don't have any live flames going on in the machine. And we have a lot of extraction pushing all the fumes out. Again, so it's less of a fire hazard. The issue with MDF is that it is very, very flammable when you have a lot of air going down on it. So you gotta get your settings dead on when you're cutting this kind of material because otherwise you either end up with a pile of cinders or you don't end up going through it at all. This here for instance was done in one pass. The engraving was done in one pass, the cutting was done in one pass. The reason why we're able to do this is because our CO2 uh, laser is 110 watts which means that it has more than enough power to cut through this. The thickest stuff we've cut through is 3 quarter inch laminate. Um, there's other ways of doing that at a better a better method of doing that but we can use the laser worst comes to worst to use to do that. Let's take a look at this being made. There you have it, cutting and engraving half inch MDF. Now what application would this be used for? I definitely would not use this for a stencil. The reason being is it's MDF. So any kind of humidity, change in the environment, whatever, it's just gonna break apart on you. It's no good. What this can be used for though is signage. You can put a clear acrylic over it or a different color acrylic and put a light behind it. Um, and then you have basically like a shining uh, maple leaf. Lots of different things you do with this stuff. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video.